All right, guys, welcome back to some more Mafia 3 Definitive Edition. So we're just going to start off right with the last of off. I just wanted to thank you guys so much for all the support that you guys have been putting on this series so far. You guys are absolutely killing it. Keep doing your doing pumps out until we eventually it beat the game. But uh, yeah, anyways, without further ado, let's get right back into this shit. All right, guys, welcome back to more Mafia 3. So... I just got done with the last part. I just drove over here, and we are going to uh, meet Burke here, I guess. So we're just going to start it, or uh, is it this one's open? Is... Okay. I guess we're going to drive through. Why is it easy to open that way, but not? Okay, whatever. Whatever. And it's broken. All right, whatever. You already finished with Barbieri. Barbieri? No. By a long shot. Already told you. Day slow. As for you. Show up like Lazarus himself. Name thinking to myself. This chalky bastard is either one of the luckiest sons of bitches that's ever lived, or the kind of man that invades rotten, damn luck. So goddamn sure it was the latter. I have to admit, I was wrong about you. You can thank me by calling me by my name. Die. Blinking it is, then. That was funny. Things get taken from us. We convince ourselves we have to go out and inflict the pain on someone else. A little man what's busted up inside of us. But it doesn't, does it? No. It does. Spent my entire goddamn life scratching and clawing at anyone who came along. Even if they were there to help. Look where it fucking got me. It's the sense. Change it. <sighs> Only way is forward. Now that Irish Point is back under your control, I'm gonna need you to bring in as much money as you can. Uh, Going after Marcano ain't gonna be cheap. Uh, and I imagine you'll be wanting your cut in the proceeds. That's right. <laughs> Can't say I'm a fan of someone looming over me. But a deal's a deal. I asked Nikki to manage those moonshine runs, but she can't bring them all on her own. That liquor hauls in a fair amount. We'll talk to her. She's around here somewhere if she ain't out quail hunting. Quail ain't in season. Oh, for her kind, it's always in season. <sighs> yeah. Oh, fuck. You'll excuse me. Oh, I have to go to see Mr. Barbieri. He's probably getting a little lonely. 
Lord Mayor. All right, assigned to Burke, whatever it is. Call in for a sit down. Oh wait, I left a big chunk of change right here. $250. All right, I got to call for a sit down. I'm not gonna do that just yet. I am going to Ooh, I'm going to collect these on the way over there. But I am going to uh, start this mission. Who we shooting? I'm going to start that one. But I am going to go collect these. Might as well. Yeah, so it'll take me a while to do all that. So I will see you guys in a bit. All right, we're going to start the next mission. I say we're going to go talk to Donovan. So here we are. By the way... I'm sponsored by denim. <laughs> I have so much denim on. I was like, oh, that's a cool jeans jacket. You know, I might wear it. And I didn't know it was all jeans. <laughs> so, yeah, I want to try something different. I want to wear some of the outfits that uh, come with the game. So, anyways, let's just start the mission. Who are we shooting? Didn't you hear? We're about to find ourselves in the middle of a race war. I've seen you shoot. I think I'll be I. <laughs> hey, with this fucking rifle, I'm Wild Bill Hickok. So, how's the Padre handling all this? You know, the bloody path of mayhem and revenge you've embarked upon? Still not happy about it. Thinks you're most likely the devil. <laughs> you know, I had a look at his service record. Oh, settle down. I was just curious. He was a medic, but he saw action at Klimbo with the 614th. He was credited with taking out two crowd tanks on top of the 16 men he shot. A lot of killing for a would-be priest. That was different. It was during a war. And this isn't? Look, I'm just saying. We didn't win that war by worrying about hurting someone's feelings. We won it by bombing the crowds and nips back to the Stone Age. Padre would be wise to remember that. Yeah, maybe. I'll catch you later. You're not still sore about me looking into the Padre, are you? Don't tell me you weren't at least a little curious. All right, anyways. Was that the whole mission? I think so. He just want to talk, apparently. Okay. Well, we are going to go... Yeah, that's it over there for now, at least. Oh, that's like a side mission. Okay, I'm going to do that. I'm going to do that real quick. Alright, finally made it to here. I'm just going to show this being part just so I can start the side missions. Thanks for earlier. My old man used to be whip smart. If anyone tried to pull some shit on him, he saw it coming a mile away. Now... Fuck. Now he barely knows the goddamn day of the week. Said you could use some help. Some of our bars are down the bayou. If you could get the shine from them and bring it back, it'd make my life a lot easier. The bayou ain't exactly my favorite place in the world. Come on now, the redneck assholes that live down there just love it when black folks drop by for a visit. <laughs> Ain't been time for small talk, but where you at with all this? All I really want is for everything to go back the way that it was. Poor Vietnam, poor that night. Back when everything felt normal. At least our version of it anyway. We are the righteously fucked. Danny. 
Was he in any pain? Did he suffer? Don't. Ain't nothing good coming from that. Who says I need good to come from it? Georgie shot him in the head. Looked like he went pretty quick. God damn it. I hate this fucking town. I better go. Yeah. Okay. Lincoln, just because Bobby Ev is dead doesn't necessarily mean this neighborhood is firmly in our control. If he's still got any men hanging around, you should think about clearing them out. All right, I can do that. I'll be doing that on the side. But yeah, so we're going to go do the next mission, which has nothing to do with that. Uh, we're going to go to the bayou and go for the sit down. So it'll take me a while to get there, so I will see you guys in a bit. All right, finally made it. All right. Let's start the mission, finally. <laughs> you think I forgot what you did? You can blame Marcana all you want, but it was your men who ambushed My us. My men were following orders. We got rules. Not my fucking problem that you people don't understand. That. Yeah, well, I'm about to make it your fucking problem. This shit is this time. Goddamn. If it ain't the city's favorite pot licking donkey, Thomas Burke. The fuck did you just say to me? Put the gun down, Burke. It's gonna take all four of us to bring down Marcana, so I don't want any more of this stupid bullshit. Bring down Marcana? These two used to work for Marcana. And this one? Do you know how many of my men this canard killed because Marcana told him to? Fuck him, and fuck you if you think I'm ever gonna trust him. Hey, these get the two. fuck out there, there's no sweat off my ass. You don't trust him? Good. Because I don't trust any of you. But that doesn't change the fact that I destroyed Barbieri's operations, killed Doucette and those other redneck motherfuckers, and saved Joe ass from Greco's men. So here's what you need to decide right fucking here now. Either fall in line or get the fuck out. Just know. Second you step out that door, your name's getting added to my list, right beneath Marcano's. Now, if we're all done acting like goddamn children, let's go over the plan. In order to bring down an organization the size of Marcano's, we need to eliminate the people at the base and work our way up. It's the same thing I did not. <laughs> I know the military filled your noggin with all manner of tactics and schemes, but let's not overthink this shit. I say we go out to his house and shoot him. It shouldn't take more than an hour or so, depending on traffic. And what you think gonna happen after? Everybody else just gonna lay down and die, you stupid ass motherfucker. Oh, Cassandra's <laughs> right. Just killing Marcano doesn't get us anywhere. One of his brothers will take over and we're right back where we started. So, first, we go after his lieutenants. Then, once they're killed, we seize their territory and move on to the Capos. Once the lieutenants and the Capos are killed, Marcano will be isolated and alone. And that's when we go after him. Hold on, what happens to those territories we get from Marcano's guys? Once it's in our hands, I'll decide who gets to run the day-to-day. I give you a district, you get the rackets and everything else. But I'm also counting on you to hold it. Keep that bastard from reclaiming it. One last thing. Y'all know that building that's going up across the lake? Hmm? It's 
building a casino. Marcano's constructing this so he can go legit. All his money's tied up into that thing, so once he figures out what we're up to, it'll limit his options. More importantly, it's an emotional attachment. Emotions make people irrational, greedy. So that's where we hit him. Right in the goddamn heart. Hey, nice speech. Think they bought it? Don't care. They're all too greedy or pissed off of Marcano to back out now. At least until one of them decides to try the crown on for size. Well, if it comes to that, I'll handle it. The photos were a nice start and all, but I'm gonna need some actionable intel on those lieutenants. A place of business, where I can find them, you name it. The dossiers are nearly complete. I'll be ready to move when you are. <laughs> I was also able to recruit some concerned citizens who are more than happy to share what they know about Sal's coalition of WAP assholes. Information on how to contact them will be included with the other intel. Appreciate it. Sure you don't need a ride? Oh, I do my own driving. Ooh. And the uh, systematic killing of Marcano's capos and lieutenants, that was part of the plan. Well, you're in plain fucking patty cake, Christ. Look, you want to bring somebody down, you destroy the foundation they're standing on. It's the same basic op we ran over Nam. All right, what now? The map has additional missions available. Meet up with Donovan to continue going after Marcano or complete optional agenda and trafficking missions for your underbosses and their lieutenants. So I have a lot of stuff to do now when I'm not recording. Uh, completing agenda and trafficking missions nets you extra cash and increases an underboss's loyalty. Press X on the map to select one of Donovan's missions or one of the optional agendas and trafficking missions. Sign of the Times. Sign of the Times now available to play. To begin Sign of the Times, go talk to Father James. Holy shit, it took that long to get to the DLC stuff? Stones Unturned is now available to play. To begin Stone Unturned, go talk to Donovan. Faster Baby is now available to play. To begin fast, maybe go talk to The Voice. Yeah, that's all DLC stuff. Racing of a I feel like we just started the game. We are on part 14, and we just started the game. <laughs> Going to the new Bordeaux racing circuit. Earn vehicle customizations and cash for completing 12 races on the mean streets of new Bordeaux. Races come in two classes, sports and exotic. Your first event uh, is in the bayou. I might do that right now, actually. That would be a good, you know, place to end the video. Your first uh, race event, bayou B figure eight, is available now. Find it on your map in bayou phantom. Okay. Hey, Lincoln, come pick me up. There's something we need to talk about. This is about Marcano? No, it's something else altogether. Just get here. All right. See you soon. All right, so I'll be doing DLC stuff uh, after I beat the game, but uh, yeah, and I'll, I don't think I'm going to be wearing many outfits because they don't even show up on title screens, so kind of sucks. But anyways, let's do the race. I say title, I meant to say cut, uh, cut scenes, cut scenes. There's a lot of stuff we unlocked, holy shit. It's just gonna keep on popping up, so. <laughs> I just gotta make sure I don't do the DLCs. Because I'm gonna do those last after I'm finished with the game. I was kinda keep that a secret until the end, but it popped up now, so I was like, yeah, I'm not doing that right now. And those DLCs I have never touched before, so this is gonna be interesting. I'm also thinking about going back to Mafia 2 and doing those DLCs because I heard they're pretty good and I've never touched them before, so I have no idea. We'll find out. Anyways, 
Let's do some racing. Shall we? Uh, use a mix of American muscles. Yeah, sport class. All right. All right, start the race. I'm ready. I am built for off-road. I do not want to copyright, copyright, copyright claims, so I'm um, turning the music off. You're currently in a racing event. Your available controls are acceleration, brake, and ram. Uh, to restart or exit a race or racing event, press X. Okay. Oh, that's how to ram. Figure that out. Damn, I was gonna fucking get him with the back tire. Ooh! Okay, that's pretty badass. Come on. Hey, there's three laps, so I got plenty of time. Excuse me, buddy. Excuse me. Oh, yeah. I'm staying here. Staying right in first. Oh, my... You asshole. Look what she did to my fucking back windshield, asshole. My back window. My back windshield. Oh, yeah, that's a thing. Oh my god, we are drifting so smoothly. Okay. And perfect. Oh shit, that motherfucker's right behind me. Nice try, buddy. Awesome, I got 1,500. And a flame decal. Did I get 150, 147? Ooh, okay. I'm gonna restart that and try and get 147. I was really close. I'm gonna try and go super fast this time. I'll try to get 147. If I can't, then that sucks. No copyright claim. I might have already gotten copyright claim by now, but whatever. The less, the better. Oh, I'm already second. Let's go. And I'm first. All right. I just got to hit these corners right, and I should get 147. But I also need to get first with 147, so I got to keep that in mind, too. I think I can do it. I just gotta go as fast as possible the whole time.
Come on. Oh my god, I'm so close. No, I'm not gonna make it. Fuck! Dude, I'm so close! Did I do better at least? I think I did better at least. <sighs> god damn it. I'm gonna need a faster car, I think. We'll do that next time. Alright, done. I do want to thank you guys so much for tuning in. Oh, new rewards unlocked? Visit Big Rick's custom shop. Yeah, to apply. Okay. New race unlocked. Uh, place at least third in each of the new races to unlock the next tier. Alright, so I'm going to try and get a new car next time. But uh, I just wanted to pop in and say thank you guys so much for all the support on this series so far. You guys are absolutely killing it. just want to pop in and say thank you for that. Uh... I love you guys. Can't thank you guys enough for all the support you put on these videos. I just want to thank you personally for that. But anyways, meantime, drop a like, leave a comment, and welcome to the revolution.